tomorrow. I went and got some flowers already this morning. Welcome back. Day two here in Lumpabon. Not that it matters, because we're going to be here a long time. And I got lots more errands to run. I'm going to pick up my bike from the delivery company and I'll show you guys how easy it is to send something whether it's a bike a motorcycle you got a big bag or something you want to travel now I'd highly recommend rather than trying to lug it along with you if possible just to send it down the road pick it up when you get there it's dirt cheap I think about six bucks I paid to send it and paid six bucks to pack it, so 12 bucks total, nothing. I'm gonna pick it up, and then I'll probably just go to take it to the shop to have them assemble it. That way I don't have to worry about messing with nothing. Right away, less than $20, I'm sure. It'll probably charge me another four bucks to throw it together. Our guy's here, our car's here. All right. to Saffron Cafe okay. and this is a popular spot so we're gonna sit by the river uh, I don't know. let's transfer real quick scan all right I just want a latte all right let's get some coffee this is a very delicious coffee spot here in Lumpabang. I think Martin's bought coffee to take home with them before from here. Uh, yeah, take a check, check it out. I'm just get a coffee and go sit by the river for sure. Let's have a quick peek in here. I'm teaching them over here, it looks like. Teach them how to make some coffee. Here you got roaster. Cool. I'm having to do a proper introduction one of these days, but for today, I'm getting some coffee. I'm hanging out with Martin. Check out this bike, y'all. Maybe it's just custom made, but pretty cool. I can sit over here for sure. You have a downstairs area. Looks like it. What's the biggest difference between Luang Prabang and living any other place that we've lived? That's basically all me and Martin have been talking about so far. <laughs> well, you get a French style cafe, the colonial style buildings, but yet it's still loud. There goes the boat. And you get one of the nicest coffees around. Grown up at top of the mountains where it's nice and cool. Two dollars. This guy's number one priority here is to get a motorbike. So we're going to see if we can't sort that out for him here in Lumpaba. It's a little challenging when you first arrive somewhere. Because, you know, most shops are geared towards foreigners. And we want a living here in Lao price <laughs> which I mean let's be reasonable and that's what <laughs> like 40 to 50 bucks is more than enough for a little scooter for a month yeah this place is very busy today I might have to come back and see if you can volunteer here or something oh some more Awesome. Munkabang Library. Yeah, there's lots of kids here today, isn't there? Where's the shop? To the left or to the right? To the left. Hello. What a cool place for the kids to come and hang out. Got all kinds of like just shaded areas so they can come. Hang out, color, write, read books. 
Very cool little spot for the kids here. How beautiful. <coughs> Villa Santi. Oh, almost it. This old French style, colonial style buildings. There's gonna be unlimited options for us to try here. All right. Ooh, they got some Luang Prabang specialties. Might be where I saw it. Khao Sai. Luang Nia. War works? <laughs> <laughs> That's like you made very direct. <laughs> There's a lot of fancy restaurants, the gallery. Nice part is that you know that you could try it. Even if you just want to sit and enjoy a beer, like it's not going to be out of a normal person's price range to have a beer at a very nice place like this. I'm guessing T minus 30 seconds, I'm going to have to be the one to find a motorcycle. Frustration's kicking in. <laughs> It says it's in the middle here. Well, there's no road. What's the address? Yeah. <laughs> Good one. Of course, yeah. <laughs> you gotta do some adjustments when you move to a new country. This is way easier than the Muslim country adjustment. <laughs> Never done that one. <laughs> you don't really need to. <laughs> Back up. <laughs> to the left. It's right in there. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> you can see all the motorcycles for right in there. <laughs> <laughs> it does not look like a motorcycle. <laughs> it's like a cool place though. Yeah, the back's even nicer. I saw a sign for motorcycles too. Tini Kai, so sold here, or here sold really, but sold here, Saiwa Moa. So Luang Prabang is famous for Saiwa, Saiwa, sai and we're gonna come try some for sure. Kai Saiwa Mambo. Saiwa Luang Prabang. Oh, when I see my long. Kung Yai Ma Yupi. Guy's sneaky, sneaky old man. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. <laughs> he told them to go right here. He's right in front of us the whole time. I'm too busy filming. We were blind as shit. <laughs> He's right in front of us. <laughs> yeah, but I was like, I was looking for a whole bunch of motorbikes. There's three <laughs> motorbikes. Well, she's at 180 by the day, so she's gonna look. And she don't have a monthly price. Yeah, of course. It's on the main road. We'll get some food. I'm starving. I swear we ate here before, but I don't know, maybe not. Really? Alright, that's about it. That works. We'll get a menu in a second here. What about the menu there? This is cheaper than Vientian, guys. Or if not just the same price, like 30 40 for whatever you want. I really want some. I wouldn't I'm dying for some Lumpenbang sausage stuff is so good. What else do I want? See that? What's that? The sausage. Yeah, it's the bottom down there. If they do it homemade, it's so damn good. Mmm, tomato and onion sounds good. It's big low. I haven't had that in a long time. Alright, I'm gonna get some crispy pork fried rice. Hot as balls right here though. Let's move over to the table with it. <laughs> They'll clean the sh It's okay to come sit down if you're in, in Asia in Laos. Even if the table's dirty, they'll clean it up for you. And it's much cooler. Oh, roast now they're on the street. 
and show her the like confirmation number I showed her nothing I said I came to get my bike this one she scanned it I don't know why she saw maybe saw the American name and just like yeah go ahead and take it <laughs> well that was fairly easy we were just walking to Mini Mart for Martin grab something ran into Lopaban Holiday Travel Co and I asked them if they could put my bike together we needed to go we needed a way to go get the bike because Martin didn't want to walk so they offered to take the truck over 100,000, like four, a little over four bucks, put the bike together for 200, and they're gonna take Martin home when I ride the bike. So, you know, total, of, I think three, 320 is what they say, something like that. So, like 17 bucks, not bad at all. And you get taken care of, so then we have transportation. Can't wait, it's been so long. It's been away from my bike. Silo. Find a hat around here. Me more kaiba. More new kaiba. More two five. I just need some hat. First, I need to probably go home and open the door for Mara since he went home without the key. With the other key. <laughs> Oops. No TV people. Hey. It's raining. The bite eats out. Side eyeball. One side eyeball. The egg and cow and side nyak. Oh, man, hot nyak eyeball man. Tong side egg. Tu kacha no. Ani hot nyak put off at egg. Oh, and cow and tong side kacha side kacha. Oh, pop chai de. Dio phai bung egg bung bua con. So I got myself a hat. What was it? A hundred thousand? Four bucks? Not bad. Needed a hat. Probably get another one. I need some exercise stuff. Like everything I have, I pretty much just tossed in bean team because it was either stuff I had brought with me a year and a half ago, or I bought it here and exercised in it every day. So <laughs> everything's worn out. And you guys know me. I'm only buying stuff that's the cheapest possible so i don't even care what brand it is leaning whatever it's exercise clothes you can destroy it anyways you know so yeah i'm gonna come back here i think martin's at home without the key so i gotta cruise back so let me show you the so we have my light which isn't as good as my last light obviously it's about the same price so i don't think it's gonna be durable because it's like a plug in your computer to charge type of thing and it's only got this little plastic, this little rubber strap, which my other one was like a screw. It was like completely screwed on. 